What's up, everybody? It's me again. How are you doing today? I hope you are doing well. Yes, as you have seen from the title of the video, this is another shoe haul. Yes, it sure is. Uh, I love fall and winter and the beginning of spring. That is my favorite time of year. And I love the clothing. I'm not a summer person. I don't like to be hot and sweaty and sticky. Uh, I like to wear sweaters and boots and skirts and tights and dresses and sweater dresses and furry vests and you name it, I've worn it. So yes, I have another shoe haul. I just did a shoe haul last week. So you are getting two in a row. Yep. And uh, I absolutely love these. I was... I happened to stumble upon these boots just to, by pure happenstance. And I think I actually saw the first ones I'm gonna show you and I fell in love with them. And then when I saw the other colors that they came in, I wanted to buy all the colors they had. They are absolutely incredible. They are very unusual. They're not your regular hey-ho type of cowboy boot, although those are great. I have a few of those. Uh, yes, and so these are a little bit different. They're very girly and I love them. Oh my gosh. When I first got them, I ordered two different colors and I had told myself, self, you only get to pick one. Well, you know, that's just not going to happen with me because once I put them on and they didn't hurt my feet, I fell in love with both colors. So yeah, I pretty much just boom, shot myself in the foot by ordering both colors because I knew in the back of my head I was going to keep both of them. So yes, without further ado, let me show you the box and then I will tell you, ow, excuse me, I got a bad shoulder. This is the box. They are by Ariat. I love Ariat boots. Uh, they are absolutely wonderful. And these are called the Women's Tailgate. And the first color I'm going to show you is in, I already forgot already, Silver Metallic. Wait till you see these. These are absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh, look at these. Aren't these great? Now, I'm gonna put one down. The great thing about this silver, what I love, is in person, and it looks like it's translating correctly on my monitor, they're not like a fake tinfoil silver. They're more of, I mean, they're silver, but they have a little bit of pewter in them, so they don't look like tinfoil or like a chrome bumper on a car. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love it. They have the, let's see, what's the best way to show you the toe? They have the snipped toe. So it's a very squared off toe instead of the actual uh, traditional rounded uh, or the pointed cowboy toe. Uh, it has, it doesn't have the really uh, slanted cowboy heel. It's got a shorter heel and it's a 10 inch boot. So, of course, you have the pulls on the side, and I love the design, the traditional uh, design on the side. And then, of course, it's got the area stamp on each side of the boot. So, as usual, I have modeled uh, both pairs of these boots, and while I'm modeling them, I'm going to read to you the actual description of the boot on the area website. So, like I said before, it's the Women Tailgate Western Boot, and I wear a size 9. I am pretty good all the way across wearing a size 9, unless it's a more expensive uh, shoe, like a pump or a slingback. Then I, then I will ha have to bump up... Blah, 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 can't talk. Then I will have to bump up to a 9.5 if it's a more expensive shoe, a bougie brand, um, yeah, I have to bump up to a nine and a half, but anyway, these are the women's tailgate boot and I will put the, uh, description number and everything you need to know down in the description box. 
Um, and I bought the silver ones off of the area website and I bought the other color off of a different website. And I will tell you that one because they were actually out of stock in my size in the other color. So again, this is the tailgate Western boot women's size nine. Uh, it's a medium, um, width, and it says it's style number 100 two nine six seven five and it says metallic finishes distressing and bold colors make this boot so fun for going out super easy to wear with dresses or skinny jeans and perfect for the woman who wants to work western style into her wardrobe 4lr technology for support and cushioning premium full grain leather foot and upper leather lining goodyear leather welt hand nailed scoured and distressed leather outsole and these boots also can be resold so the shaft is 10 inches uh, the technology filter is 4lr the toe shape is snip and the technology is 4lr and they come in i will do a screen recording on the area website of the other colors that they come in. They come in silver, they come in peacock blue, they come in distress gold. And that's another color I'm thinking about getting because I love the silver so much that I wear gold just as often. I look good in either silver or gold. So my skin tone is, even though I have yellow undertones, uh, either silver or, or gold looks pretty good on me. So I love the gold. Uh, I also love the color. Um, what color is this? It doesn't say. I believe this is sangria in black, but it doesn't say. It just says black, but I believe it has the sangria piping and the sangria accents and the boot is black and the heel is it also has been uh, distressed and it's got that sangria red on the heel. And I love those. Oh my gosh, they are so beautiful. And then of course, they come in weathered rust, which is a beautiful brown. And it looks like a cream. I'm not sure if that's white. To me, it looks cream. So these are gorgeous, gorgeous colors. I love the boot it is very very comfortable right out of the gate i didn't even have to break it in it doesn't hurt my toe my pinky toe whatsoever i've told you before in my other shoe hauls that if a shoe hurts my pinky toe it's probably gonna hurt my pinky toe forever because they just it just will and then i won't wear them but these are very, very comfortable. My right foot fits really well. My right foot is bigger than my left. And my left foot fits just as well. So I love these. I think these are so great. As you have seen by me modeling these boots for you, I'm just, I just have a pair of skinny distressed jeans on. So I love these. They're so, so gorgeous. Uh, they're not very tall and i like that because especially for the silver i think if they were a really tall boot where it comes underneath your knee it would look too too much and it would be overpowering there would be nothing you could wear uh that could balance that out so i'm glad they're only about a 10 inch boot which i think is great i love it and i love the snip toe you'll be able to see it on the other color i'm going to show you in just a second uh, I love the snip toe. I love the squared off toe. It's uh, one of my favorites. And I think that's what makes it so girly for me. I love that. All right. So the next one I got is also a, a tailgate Aria boot. Uh, but I got it in a different color. Now, when I saw the silver, I think I saw the silver on... Where did I see the silver? I don't think it was DSW. I think I was just looking for cowboy boots and it sent me to the Aria website and I saw the silver. And then once I clicked on to see what other colors they had, I saw this color on the Aria website, but they were out of my size. 
So I actually had to buy the Peacock Blue, which is the ones I got. So I will show you both boots and then I will put one down. So here is the Peacock Blue. It's gorgeous. Oh, I love this color. It reminds me, this color, it it's, looks teal to me. I think Peacock Blue must be a more modern name for teal. Um, but they remind me of the 80s and anything teal reminds me of the 80s and I just love it. As you have seen by my last shoe haul, I hauled the, um, the uh, Little Western Booty by Jessica Simpson and that is also in a peacock blue, but it's, it's more teal in person and I love it. So I saw these on the Aria website and they didn't have my size. So I had to order these from Shepler's and we do have a Shepler's here in Denver. So they were a lot cheaper at Shepler's, but they didn't have them in stock this color at the store. So had they had this color in stock at the store, um, they probably would have been a little less expensive because they were about $20 cheaper on the Shepler's website. But because I had to pay tax because I have a Shepler's here, they were actually a dollar less than the silver one. So I saved a whole buck by ordering them from Shepler's. So these are absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to put one down. I love them. It's got the sort of goldy rose gold detailing on both sides. See that? And then, of course, the stitching is sort of uh, a bronze and a gold. And as you can see, uh, probably with these ones, you could see the more squared off toe. Um, it's got the stitching around the sole of the shoe and the heel is distressed. And as you can see, the sole is actually distressed as well. So I love these. Of course, it's got the Ariat stamp on there and it also has that same cowhide material on the inside. And it's got the gold or it looks kind of rose goldy or copper uh, in these lights. But these are absolutely gorgeous. I They're both so comfortable right out of the gate. And not to put down a company, but my Dan Post boots are i had to break those in and once i broke them in they were great but these are absolutely comfortable they fit my feet both you know my left foot is smaller than my right foot i've told you before but uh they fit perfectly on both sides each the silver ones and the peacock blue i love them i absolutely love them again they're 10 inches tall uh the heel is not that high i'm not sure if somebody could comment down below what kind of heel this is compared to your traditional uh, cowboy heel. If I could find my Dan Post ones, I will put that in a PNG right here. And um, yeah, the heel is a little bit taller, a little bit chunkier. Um, and uh, my uh, neurosurgeon, when I had back surgery, he had told me, my neurologist, he had said that cowboy boots were great for people who have back issues because it sort of aligns your spine the correct way. Uh, wearing flats or even gym shoes or high heels are not very good for your back. And he is the one who told me to wear cowboy boots that that would really help align my spine and I would most likely have less knee issues and back issues. So I did, that's when I went and bought my Dan Post boots. They're in a black cherry color. They're gorgeous. I love those and I get so many compliments when I wear those boots. I actually should have brought them down here, but I forgot. So love these, love the tailgate. I I want the gold ones. And um, yeah, my husband saw these and he's like, wow, it must be nice to be loaded to be able to buy two pairs of Ariat uh, cowboy boots. And I said, well, they really weren't that expensive uh, compared to my Dan Post's. My Nan posts were over $200 and I want to say I paid, these are on sale on the Aria website, I believe for $119, which isn't bad for a, a cowboy boot from Aria. Uh, it's absolutely a really good price and all color, all the colors are $119. I love the black one with the sangria as well. So I'm kind of torn whether I should get the gold or the black and the sangria. 
Uh, the Sangria is more of a maroony, ready red. And my Dan Posts are more of a black cherry sort of, or blackened purple. So they wouldn't be the same, but it would be nice to have a pair of black boots as well. So yeah, I love these. I think they're wonderful. Uh, the shipping from Ariet was really fast. I think I ordered them on a Friday and they, and I got them by Tuesday. And then I ordered the Peacock Blue ones on Saturday. They came from the store here in Denver and I didn't get them until Thursday or Friday. So it was actually slower ordering them from a store here in the same city I live in, in Denver, than it was for them to come from Aria, which wherever that's from. So yeah, they were really, really fast. They actually were shipped out. I think I saw them around 12 in the 12 noon and they were shipped out. I got a notification by like four or 5 PM that they had already shipped out. So they're very comfortable. I would highly recommend them. They, uh, I love them and I can't wait to wear them this fall and winter with sweaters, with, uh, my skinny jeans like I have on today, or, you know, uh, I used to wear them back in the day. I hate that. I hate that saying, but it is true. Back in the eighties, I used to wear them with stretch pants and baby doll dresses. Comment down below if you, uh, wore baby doll dresses. Yes, I used to wear them with stretch pants and baby doll dresses. I had tons of baby doll dresses or like longer version. It was still like a baby doll dress, but it was like a maxi dress. And I used to wear a black cat suit underneath and I would wear black cowboy boots. I loved it. I used to sport that all the time. Probably about a good three years. I went through several pairs of cowboy boots because... I was too poor to buy really great, you know, really good quality cowboy boots like these. I just used to buy the super cheap ones. So that's why I used to go through a pair every year. Uh, but with these, yeah, these are gorgeous. I love them. I'm keeping them both. Uh, you have seen by me modeling both of these colors for you. I will show you both colors side by side right now while I continue to talk and let me know and tell me which one is your favorite. Uh, I love both of them. Like I said, I love the gold and I love the black and sangria. I'm torn. I don't know if I need three pairs of cowboy boots uh, in three different colors, or maybe I do. So, <laughs> you know, it just depends on how rich I feel uh, that particular day or, um, you know, uh, or not. So we shall see. It'll be a surprise as usual. So anyway, that's it, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for being here and, uh, watching my video. I truly appreciate it. As always, everything you need to know about these boots, I will link both Ariat and Shepler's down below the link to these boots. And, uh, let me know which color you like the best and let me know what you think of the gold ones. Should I buy the gold ones or the black and sangria? Let me know. Um, yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards the black seems more practical, but I like the gold because it's unusual. And I like to be one of those uh, types of people that stands out in a crowd that is, uh, you know, doesn't go with the flow. I like to be my own individual self. Anyway, off topic as usual. Anyway, I was saying goodbye. So thanks so much for sticking around, everybody. Sorry about the voice. Got the old laryngitis, but I thought I would film this for you anyway. Thanks for watching, everyone. Remember to uh, hit the like button if you so prefer. Also remember to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified of all of my videos in the future. I thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. See you later, everybody. Ciao. Bye-bye.